Come on in, my beautiful hustlers. My hustlers. Come on in to the movie I'm coming in to. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it together as a family. Come on. Come on. Hey, y'all. Come on in. Bring your Kool-Aid, your cocktail, your water. Bring your food and snacks. Let's sit and chat with who? Me and who? Girl to the hood. Hey, y'all. Uh, this is Sunday dinner. We have some macaroni and cheese. We have green beans. We have roasted chicken and uh, potatoes. Uh, yeah, this is going to be really good, y'all. just finished cooking as well. Y'all see the smoke? Uh, this is a scene one, take one, without a do. Let's roll the tape. Hey, how y'all doing? Let's say prayers. Thank you, God, for this another day. Thank you for mercy's new grace is sufficient, sovereignty, love, and forgiveness. Let this food be nourishment to my beautiful and healthy body. In the name of Jesus, I pray amen and amen. So, y'all. Look, y'all want some? I love Sunday dinners, you know? So we have mac and cheese. We have the roasted chicken and potatoes. And then over here we have some green beans. And so without ado, because it's hot, y'all know I love my food hot. Let's dig in. Oh, we have to toast, don't we? Mm. Okay, we're coming into a new week. Uh, tomorrow, uh, I know a lot of us are off, so... This toast is going to be for a new week with new blessings. Yeah. So, salute, salute. Let's sip, sip this good water. Cheers. Uh-oh. Dang, that's good. I wanted that water. Oh, that a top is. I was looking for the top, y'all. All right, y'all. Let me get y'all one of these potatoes. Look at that good, oh, I don't want it to fall. Look at that good roasted potato, y'all. Mmm, yum, yum, give me some. Y'all, my hair is really growing. It really is growing, y'all. Can y'all see it? Let's see. I probably shouldn't do anything with this camera. Y'all see, my hair really is growing. Uh, I'm trying to wear, y'all. Mmm. Damn, that's good. So how are y'all day going? What are y'all eating with me? Y'all, last night I was drinking. I did a random video with some spicy noodles and the rest of that stew, Jamaican chicken. Beware. <laughs> it wasn't too bad. But it is, it is all over the place, y'all, so get ready to see it. Mm-hmm. It's good. Mm. The potato's good. Mm, mm, mm. It's a mac. One thing I said a long, I said it a long time ago though. Some things will always bring families and friends together, food and drink. Mm -hmm. I mean, this this season of COVID changed some things. But I'm going to tell y'all, I think, mm, oh goodness, I think people are so bored now because we've been in this house for almost a year. When I look at pictures uh, here in Houston uh, with the trail riders and the parties and they don't, they not, everybody not wearing a mask. And uh, when you're dancing, some people dance with it. Some people have it underneath the nose, and some people have it under their neck. I know everybody, but I'm, I'm bored too. But y'all know I can have a party in my house. <clears throat> I dance on the weekend and through the week. You got to know how to choose happy and create and create a happiness too. Because their masks are not going to be going away too soon. Mm, my God. So good. Black up from top of the today. day. 
So, y'all, we got to do something, but we still got to be safe with it, you know? Don't be foolish. I said on that random video when I was drinking, because I was drinking, I was drinking. Uh, Dame Dash now put out a video revealing that they were, were, were positive for COVID. And they sent sauces out. And I'm thinking like, well, I know they're probably going to tell them not to eat it. I didn't look at the whole video. But. Mm, that's good. But even when we go out to eat. Or we go out. I don't go out. I don't sit in the restaurants. But I order food maybe once or twice a month. And we don't know who's cooking that food. And we don't know if they're healthy. That's why you have to pray over your food, you know? Ooh. Or cook it in your kitchen. Because this COVID thing is real. I remember at the beginning, I had my doubt. Not no more. I want to live. Well, God God already had numbered our days anyway. It's already written. And we don't know why we're going to die. But we will. Y'all got some onions and stuff that I baked with this chicken? Mm, it's hot too. I'm going to give y'all a bite. Oh, it's hot. Y'all, and I burnt myself real good. Here, take a bite. Mm -hmm. I'm going to put some hot sauce on it. Y'all, look at this burn. Y'all see that burn? I burnt myself really good uh, in that on that oven rack. It's not good when your flesh is burning. <laughs> Imagine what hell is going to be about. Ooh, the smell. Mm -mm. Oh. This chicken is the bomb. Mm-hmm. Damn, it's good. Mm-hmm. And y'all, at first I thought I was going to be doing some uh, pork bones in the slow cooker with the uh, brown gravy. But I realized I had these chicken uh, legs in my Freeze, I think this was the third week, and I don't like to leave my meat that long in the freezer, so I had to cook it. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is doing good. Mm-mm-mm. Forget that. Mm-mm. <clears throat> The upper weather is good here, too. I think the high today is 62. And I think the low is 40. 41. Mm-hmm. This is good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, guess what I ate? Um, I'm waiting for my food to uh, cook. Some smoked Vienna sausage with some hot sauce and ruffles. <laughs> Potato chip. It was good. I told y'all, David, uh, well, you know, when we were poor, we ate the Spam and the Vienna sausage in there. 60s and the 70s. And I hadn't eat them, eaten them from then. When I got grown, I was like, I ain't eating that mess. And I didn't. But last year, David said, Mama, but they they got flavors of Vienna sausage. I'm like, and they do. They got barbecue. They got smoke. They got hot. I mean, spicy. 
I'm thinking like, okay, well, I, I tried to buy them all. I ain't like anything but the smoke. The smoke is really good with hot sauce. I don't eat them every day. Or every week either. Maybe a can every two or three months. Mm -hmm. I don't eat them every day, every week. Mm. This is so good. You know, <laughs> Because I'm not a big beef eater, unless I'm doing uh, pasta or tacos, of course. I'm always eating seafood and chicken. You know, I know one thing. YouTube is just so saturated with people eating, you know. And sometimes you just want to look at something different. So, I know me. I, I'm following my band people and I do uh, still look at uh, people that I like as well. But I don't look at eating videos all day anymore. I just don't. I really don't. This roasted potato is good. Mm, mm, mm. Mm. The whole Sunday meal is good. Now, I hope I never lose my passion for Sunday dinners, you know? I just want the families back around the tables. You understand? Talking and laughing and passing the food to your right or your left and just loving on each other, you know? That's important to me. It really is. Very important to me. I don't know one thing. I got some new neighbors in the building. I think they're on the fifth floor. Maybe they maybe on the fourth floor. Because I'm on the third floor. Mm -mm. mm. Y'all know it's good when you don't leave nothing on that bone. They don't go, they don't, obviously they don't use the elevator. Well, maybe their apartment is by the stairs like mine is. Mine, my, my apartment is near the stairs and not the elevator. But, excuse me. Oh, excuse me. They run up and down these stairs all day. Mm. So I'm thinking, I'm teenage boys. Yeah, they doing it again. They don't walk. They run. <laughs> of course, they stomp on the staff as they coming up and down. Mm-hmm. Sometimes I'm going to open the door and say, y'all, stop that by my door. Mm. You know, sometimes people stop right there on the stairs and they, they have a conversation. I don't mind that because I'm nervous. I want to know if they plotting to blow the building up, you know? <laughs> you better know your neighbors. So important. You know your neighbor. 
Yeah. Look at that plate. I have been eating, haven't I? Mm -hmm. But I wanted this food because it, it was good. I knew it was going to be good because I love chicken. Y'all know I haven't been eating shrimp that much. Mm, that potato is good. Mm. Mm. I saw another guy do some wings with uh lemon pepper wings. Y'all know I'm doing them this weekend, right? But I'm going to do Taylor's again, too, because I told my neighbor about it. And I told her I was going to fix them and invite her over. So I'll be doing Taylor, uh, Taylor's uh, wings again. And uh, the ones I did last weekend, y'all, the, uh, the spicy and sweet uh, wings from Taylor's uh, Barbecue and Smoke or something. Y'all remember the video. I'm going to do them again, but I'm going to do this man that did the lemon pepper video. He says it's better than Wingstop. I know Taylor's was better than Wingstop. I'm going to lie. That's, that was good. So, I'm going to try this guy's out. Uh, I'm gonna, so, I'm going to do two batches of uh, of wings. Mm-hmm. Mm. Y'all, y'all think I could eat this last piece of chicken? I don't know, because I'm breathing hard already. I think I'm full, and we're running out of time, of course. It really is good, though. Maybe I'll save it. So when I have my cocktail for the day, and I'll get hungry, I'll have this piece of chicken. I'll, I'll have it, y'all. So, look here. Y'all ready to sing yourself out? Mm. Thank y'all for coming. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button. And comment down below. Thank y'all. Let's sing. You ready? It's time to say goodbye for now. We have another chance around on the other side. So whatever y'all do today, do it good, do it with purpose, and of course, do it with what? Genuine love. Goodbye for now.